What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Isaiah, and I'm back at it again with another video today. We're going strong. Today is Thursday, so the theme for today is Thursday's trash. If for those of y'all who don't know, um, I take out the trash on Thursdays, so I thought I would talk about some shoes that look really ugly, um, that are trash, uh, thumbs down. You know, shoes that I don't think anybody would like or shoes that are funny looking. I'm not going to say that any like nobody would like them, but shoes that I think are very funny looking. And we can just talk about them. Um, Y'all see the yellow hoodie today, you know, so hoodie as they activate it. I thought since, you know, I like to do the little Kobe trash can thing. I thought, you know, yellow hoodie for Kobe. You feel me? Um. Thought it was a pretty cool idea. Tell me if y'all like it. I might stick with it. You know what I'm saying? So every Thursday, I might have the yellow hoodie on for Kobe. You know, we like to throw the trash shoes in the trash can. Um, hit them with that Kobe. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe hit them with that Skyhook Kareem. Um, he was also a Laker. I chose, you know, because Kobe was a Laker. And their colors are yellow and or gold and purple or whatnot. So... You know, it's just a cool little idea, fun little idea. Tell me if y'all like it. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the first shoe on Thursday's trash. So the first shoe on the, today's list is the Jordan 2 Zion Voodoo. Um, this is on the Nike website. They got a couple sizes left on the Nike website. They're retailing for like 140, 160 ish. So it's not a bad shoe, like pricing wise, but I mean, just off of looks alone, I think you could get a better looking shoe. Um, and me personally, I mean, I haven't heard anything special about the shoe. I haven't heard anything bad, but I haven't heard anything good about it either. In my opinion, if it was a good basketball shoe, I'm pretty sure people would have been talking about it by now. And, you know, I mean, just looking at the shoe, um, it just looked like a big a big carpet on your foot, man. Like, I, I mean, if I'm going to play ball, I don't want to look like I have a carpet on my foot. I know it's designed after a voodoo doll, hence the name voodoo. But, I mean, this is the ugly looking shoe, especially to play ball in, bro. Like, thumbs down, man. Um, I mean, I like the color. I like, I, I like the idea. It's unique. It's cool. Um, and he actually did put it on, they gave him like a Jordan one low and they put it on there, like the voodoo design. And that actually looked pretty nice. Um, but on this basketball shoe, not a bro. Um, and the shoe just looked really bulky too. You know what I'm saying? But Zion is a big, bigger guy. So I understand why the shoe would look bulky, but I mean, just look at like a, like a fur ball or something on your foot, man. Like. I don't know, bro. This shoe look trash. And with that being said, um, Kobe, them things into the trash. I'm going to stock them on my stand right there, y'all. All right. With that being said, though, on to the next shoe. All right. So the second shoe on today's list is the Martina, Martin Rose X Nike Shocks. Um, I mean, do I really got to say much about the shoe? Like, it looked like it got, I don't even know what to, I don't even know what to say, bro. Like, you got these like little poles in the back, red poles. Like, it, it almost looked like a Nike high heel or something like that. It looked like they took like the grill them up fours and just stuck a big old tower or log, a red log in the back. I don't know, bro. These, these just ugly, bro. <laughs> <laughs> they just ugly and then what make it even worse is if you want a pair like i'm on these shoes have already come out uh so you gotta go on like stock x or goat um for that like average shoe size bro you're paying over like four hundred dollars for these <laughs> like for my size ten and a half bro i'm paying uh, the the baseline price is 395 <laughs> what Bro, what? <laughs> so that me and that's without tax and shipping and all that stuff, all that stuff that we love. Um, 
So if you ask me, if you gonna spend four hundred dollars on a shoe, this ain't the one, bro. Like this ain't the one, bro. <laughs> like look at it, bro. <laughs> like look at look at the look at the log pole. I don't even know what to call that thing, bro. <laughs> Go ahead and call me these things since it's trash can. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, uh, they trash and on to the next shoe. All right, the next shoe. Um, I don't like them at all. I don't like none of these shoes. Um, but this is an unpopular opinion of mine. But I don't like Crocs. Okay, that's just me though. I I just don't. I don't get it. I don't. I don't mess with Crocs. Um, you, I just don't mess with Crocs. I've heard great things about them, but I, you never catch me wearing Crocs, even if someone bought them for me. And then these right here, these these uh, Sally Bembury Croc Polix Clog Sasquatch Junts, bro. Um, yeah, no. Uh, it looked like they took a Croc and like you know the um, the symbiote from Spider Man, uh, Venom. It just looked like they slapped a whole bunch of symbiote on top of the shoe. What make it even worse, bro, is this shoe already came out. It retailed for $85. Who paying, first of all, who paying $85 for one, for, cro for Crocs, for Crocs? I'm pretty sure they're way cheaper than that. You go in the mall and get a pair for like 15, 20 bucks. I could be wrong. I don't know, I don't know Crocs like that. They retail for 85 bucks. But now if you want to get them, they're on stock X. These jumps are over $400. You paying $400 for this? They got Velcro on the back, bro. Get you some Skechers. Like, no, nah, let, let me not bash Skechers. But like, bro, you paying $400 for this? $400 for this. For this right here. Come on, man. The symbiote croc. Symbiote one croc. I mean actually the name the name is Sasquatch. You know what? I you didn't get to see me do the full Kobe thing. So you know what these so bad. I'm gonna, uh, 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 Kobe. That's how bad they are. That's how bad they are. Again. Kobe. All right, so this next shoe on the list is um, an Adidas shoe. I believe it says right here it's Pharrell shoe. So Pharrell got another shoe. Um, this is the Adidas H-U-N-M-D-S-I Rat Cardboard. Um, man, I struggled with that name. Um, I mean, bro, it, it looked like he tried to take a Tim, a Timberland. And like, there's some Back to the Future stuff with it. Like, I mean, it's just, I've seen some pictures of the shoe on foot that actually make it look better on foot. But I mean, like these, I, mean, I don't know, man. It looks like some electronic Timberlands or something, or Back to the Future Timberlands. I don't know, bro. It's, and then the name Cardboard, like, why, why do you put Cardboard, bro? Like. You got a little, look like you got cardboard to glow on your feet, bro. Like, I don't know. Just is just trash. I like Pharrell. I do like his other shoes, but this one right here, and it's retailing for like $250. These drop on, um, I believe these drop tomorrow, actually. Yeah, these drop um, September the 2nd um, for $250. Uh, it look a little fancy, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what be going through these creators, designers, heads. Um, I, like I said, I've seen some pictures of the shoe on foot that actually make it look kind of nice. But I mean, this look like a shoe. It look like a shoe that they made back in the day to be like, you put these on, you jump 20 inches higher. That, that's the type of shoe this, that's, this is what this shoe look like. You can put it on and you jump 20 inches higher. <laughs> um, but yeah, with that being said, go ahead and Kobe these things into the trash. Yes, sir. On to the next shoe. All right, so this next shoe is the Adidas Y3 GR1P. Um, these are 
supposed to be reselling for three hundred dollars. These don't have a release date yet. Um, but I mean, like, why would you pay three hundred dollars for this? If you want a pair of all black shoes, bro, get you some all black Air Force ones. I know we all make the little jokes about them and stuff like that, but if it's why well, would you pay three hundred dollars for this, bro? It just it just um it just don't sit right. Like I couldn't even imagine these looking good on feet, bro. Like it's just it just look like big old just like you got coal on your feet, bro. Like, I don't even know, like just and then like what's up with the 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 mid so like why why is it like it look like it got three different layers like I don't I don't know what's going on here um yeah just this shoe is just ugly bro I don't know what to tell you this shoe built like Zion <laughs> Let me stop. Uh -oh. <laughs> we got yeah. honestly the other ones look like high on too. <laughs> they built like him too. All these big bulky shoes, man. Um, uh, y'all gonna think I hate that man? I don't hate that man. I just think he overhyped. Um, but you know, I mean, I don't. You know what? Forget this. On to the next shoe, Kobe. All right, so the last shoe we got today is another Adidas shoe. Adidas really did one this week. Um, and this is the Adidas Y3 4D Runner. And if you ask me personally, this shoe really isn't ugly, ugly, or like it's not, it's like, it's just plain looking. But here's here's why here's why I made the list. This shoe would be retailing for $450. Now, don't get me wrong. Dude, like, I don't... For $450, you couldn't make this look better. This is like the most plain looking shoe I've ever seen in my entire life. For $450, you couldn't have made this look better, bro? Adidas. I know y'all can make shoes look better than this. Because I've seen you do it. The Ultra Boost 22 looks better than this and it's for two hundred dollars and you charging 450 for this it's just so this shoe made the list more so because of its plainness and the price point that adidas is charging now i understand that this 4d technology is very unique and different um but i mean you you couldn't like you couldn't do nothing with this like this is the most it's just so plain looking like it's, it's not necessarily funny looking to me. At least it's not funny looking to me, at least. But it's not like, and it's not ugly, but it's not like, for $450, bro, why would you, why would you do that? Why don't, what, what what were you thinking? It's so plain looking. Like, I can see you charging $450 for the Ultra Boost 22, depending on the colorway, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, that shoe just looks better. You know, it's but like this shoe don't this shoe don't look like much. Like if I if I would have thought if I if you would have seen me wearing these, you would not think these are four hundred fifty dollars. And then if I did tell you how much they were, you'd be like, why you spend four hundred fifty dollars on that shoe? I'm just saying. So with all due respect, you this the four D runner. Um, it's not really ugly or funny looking to me. It's just plain looking, and this price point is just absolutely absurd. So this is why it made the list for Thursday's trash. And with that being said, go ahead and post it up. Uh, uh, and then Kobe that thing into the trash, yes sir. Um, and yeah. And that right there was the end of the end of the trash Thursday junts. Uh, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, hit that notification bell button. And share with your mom, dad, uncle, auntie, cat, dog, fish, brother, sister, whatever, whoever you want to share with. We just trying to make the channel grow. Um, we got a goal reaching 250 subscribers by the end of the year. We're at 77 right now, so we're close to 100. Um, I think we can do it. 
we just gotta keep on trying and uh if y'all notice at the beginning of the video i just said it's your boy isaiah um we i've listened to a couple people and i think i'm a well i'm going to change my name to something else i'll make a video on that another time but i get a lot of i've gotten a lot of feedback on that name and i'll i'll make a video about that another day um so with that being said your boy isaiah is out peace